Best Binoculars and Telescopes for Beginners Hi, Night Owl here. Observing the night sky, is like, birdwatching. If an object is bright and close, it is clearly visible with the naked eye. As the object move further away, it becomes smaller and fainter. Then you will either need a binocular or telescope to observe it. As the object move even further away, it become what I call, a why bother object. The best viewing conditions are dark moonless nights, with as little light pollution as possible from your surroundings. Keep in mind that light pollution, can have an influence on the brightness of the objects, and humidity, or moisture in the atmosphere, can distort the objects in the night sky. If you want to obtain either binoculars or a small telescope for night sky viewing, the primary objective is to gather light, and not magnification. The bigger the aperture, or diameter of the front lens, the more light the instrument gather to increase the brightness of the image you observe. You will be disappointed if you get excellent magnification, but your instrument cannot gather enough light to experience the full beauty of the object. I propose that you obtain one of the more trusted brand names. Also keep in mind, though you can observe some stars in color, most of them, and deep sky objects like star clusters, nebula and galaxies are observed in black and white. The pupil of your eye got a very small aperture, and though binoculars or telescopes, focus more light into your eyes, it is not enough to experience it in color. The reason why you get nice colored images of deep sky object, are because hundreds of photos, collected over hours, to ensure that as much light as possible are collected, and then stacked on top of each other, to display these beautiful colored objects. It is definitely a benefit to have either binoculars or a small telescope, or both, to see the more distant and smaller objects in the night sky. Allow your binoculars, or telescope, approximately 30 minutes to take up the ambient temperature of your observation surroundings, before viewing the night sky. If there is a difference in temperature between the inside and outside of the binoculars or telescope, the lenses may fog up, or you may get distortion of the night sky. My recommendations for binoculars 10 by 50 Poro Prism binoculars With eye relief of minimum 17 mm or 0.7 inches, to ensure that people wearing glasses can also use the binoculars with comfort. Fully multi-coated optics, to reduce light pollution and ensure clearer observations. Twistable eye cups, to block direct light to your eyes, also for clearer observations. It is lightweight, does not require a tripod. Quick to search through the night sky, and easy to handle for prolonged observation sessions. I would also suggest that you sit back on a pool chair or stretcher. Ensure that your head and elbows are comfortably supported for prolonged observation sessions. It will also help to stabilize the image in the binocular. If you want to observe more, I recommend that you get a small telescope, not a bigger binocular. My recommendations for small telescopes. First choice, 130 mm or 5 inch, focal ratio f5 reflector telescope, or second choice, 150 mm or 6 inch, focal ratio f10 Schmidt Cassegrain telescope. Both with sturdy manual altitude azimuth mount. Accessories, collimation eyepiece, to assist in the alignment of the optic mirrors and lenses, to ensure a clear and sharp view. 2 times Barlow lens, to increase the magnification of the smaller brighter objects. And a lens cleaning kit. Make sure that these accessories are the same diameter as your standard eyepiece. Some of these telescopes come with computerized altitude azimuth mounts, but I recommend that you try to obtain them with manual altitude azimuth mounts. It does not require polar alignment and will reduce the investment cost significantly. These telescopes are still in the category for easy transport and assembly. If you go bigger, it will be more expensive, bulkier, and more difficult to assemble, and if you go smaller, you will not gain much on the 10 by 50 binocular. If you are interested and want to unlock the night sky, please subscribe to my channel, to view existing and get notifications for future videos. Also click on the links below to gain access to my observation lists and star charts, 
with marked position of the bigger and brighter objects. Happy hunting, and enjoy the treasures of the night sky.